Anderson, delivered by Michael Fabiano. And I cannot believe I'm going to ask a question about this guy, Fabs. But it feels legitimate at this point, David Johnson. He went first in both of my fantasy drafts. Uh huh. But you got to ask if you should sit him this week against the Bears. He's not been good. If you have backfield depth, oh. I would sit him in terms of points scored, yards, and passing yards. But their quarterback is averaging four yards in a tenth. It's just not good. And they're playing the Bears. So beware, DJ, this week. All right, how about Shady? No Another touchdowns so far, 61 big rushing yards. Name running back, and if he's active, he needs to sit. Right now, he's 40th in fantasy points in PPR leagues among running backs. And Lindsey, the Vikings defense is tough. So he's not a le- he's not 100 percent against the Vikings. I'm passing here. Will Fuller of the Texans, what do you do with him? Oh, I'm starting him. I, I like this guy. In five starts where Fuller has played with Deshaun Watson. He's had eight touchdowns. He's averaging almost 80 yards a game. So why wouldn't you start this guy? He's been dynamite when Deshaun Watson is his quarterback. All right, start him until it doesn't work anymore. How about Demarius Thomas against the Baltimore Ravens defense, which has been good. That is a sit for me, Demarius Thomas against a Ravens defense. That is very tough on wide receivers at home. I don't even need to be here because there she's giving the analysis. All right. Well, then, you, you are, know, bye. You are the See you guys. <laughs> I'm out of here. More from uh, Michael Fabiano. If you have any more questions, we haven't covered it in NFL.com. You can also see him weeknights at 5 Eastern on NFL Fantasy Live. Or you can just watch this show. Oh. They're never boring. Those Pittsburgh Steelers and their game this week should be anything but the 8-3 and three Chargers coming to town on Sunday night, Sean. But they won't have Melvin Gordon with them. What does that mean for L.A.? Yeah, it certainly is an impact for the, the Chargers. But I think when you look at Austin Eckler, the explosive plays, look, the Chargers have one of the most... Gordon and a full yard more than Gordon per touch. Eek. This is such a good yeah, story, Malcolm. I love it. I, I want to know if you are still in touch with the book club members down there in Georgia. I am. They text me all the time. You know? That's awesome. Uh, they must be Falcons fans, I would imagine. Of course not. They better not be. You At know? least not they said telling you that. They said they were rooting for the Patriots, so I believe them. Okay. Uh, any new book clubs? Have you expanded since then? It brought any Patriots into the fold? You know, the ladies are... They even mentioned uh, what really, was really funny is if their husbands try to come downstairs when I come over, they don't let them out. <laughs> <laughs> what about Reese Witherspoon? She reached out to you. Oh, I'm coming. I'm on the way. Who would you love to be in a book club with, aside from Reese? I uh, yeah, he he's has just to. like X's and O's constantly. No, he's a pretty intelligent person. He loves history. So. Um, your book that you right. wrote, right? What was that experience like? So my book is The Magician's. Would you write another book, or do you I'm feel like that? I, I have wrote another book. You have one. Due time. You know, I'm working, trying to work with publishers right now to get the books on a bigger platform. That way, you know, more of my work can be out. Biographies. Very, very yeah. interesting. Uh, and you can have uh, find out more information about all of this and his programs at readwithmalcolm.com. Yeah. Bucky Brooks will be a part of our live coverage at 10 a.m. Eastern. What will you and the other scouts who are watching be looking for here? So many things that you want to look for at a pro day, but the first thing you want to look for is the measurement. You're trying to figure out what he is as a franchise quarterback. Why is that important? Because there are going to be some people who hear that, who kind of roll their eyes and think of the Bo Callahan, uh, how many people went to his <laughs> birthday party from the movie Draft Day, right? Like, why is that an important thing for a quarterback? Murray has that kind of connection with his teammates at Oklahoma. Uh, there was so much talk about his interviews at the Combine. There are usually interviews that take place surrounding a pro day, too. Is that important for him also to show people what he knows about football after one year as a starter? Absolutely. I think it goes a long way to determining, okay, if it would take him to get there. Again, Wednesday at 10 a.m. Eastern, the time for all of this to go down live coverage right here on NFL Network and lots more from Bucky up at NFL.com slash Scouts Notebook.